Welcome back to the Crew Motor Fest. We are continuing our Let's Play with this, our BMW M4 Liberty Walk that we unlocked in the last episode. If we complete one more playlist, we get access to the main stage. But what playlist shall we do? I've already got rewards. Thanks, game. Every time you complete a playlist, at the end of the playlist, you get a special car added to your garage. If we do the 911 Legacy, we we will get a special 911 added to our garage completely for free. If we do automobile Lamborghini, we will get a Lambo. A lot of people also say donut. DJ says the donut media story is better than the Forza Horizon one. All right, how hard can it be? Donut media, here we come. I'm also doing something very illegal today. Thrustmaster decided to sponsor this video and asked if I could use their eSwap controller. The only Thrustmaster eSwap controller I have is the Forza Horizon. Ryzen 5 version. So, um, if anybody from the Crew Motor Fest is watching this, I do apologize. <laughs> Anyways, let's begin the Donut Media playlist. Lightning, baby! Everybody in chat's just spamming lightning, lightning, lightning. Welcome to Donut Media. Mission number one, let's go. Which beast owns the mountain? The Italian stallion? Or the Stromboli bully. I'm going Lamborghini. <laughs> Welcome to the most controversial video I have ever made. Lamborghini versus Ferrari. Here's the deal. In the last episode, I drove that Lamborghini Huracan, the Performante that I absolutely fell in love with. I think I need to buy one of those sooner rather than later. This one isn't bad, but the Performante was insane. This story is actually pretty short, and I think we're also going to get a rare car after we complete it. Look at the Ferrari doing a drift. I am on like one of the hardest hardest difficulties in this game, so we need to not do that. Use that Forza Horizon 5 controller to the limit. Speaking of Thrustmaster, if you missed it, in the last episode, we started up a giveaway for the Thrustmaster T248 racing wheel. It's currently open over on the AR12 Discord server, and you can enter for a chance to win. There's a link down below if you want to join. Thanks to Thrustmaster for once again supporting the supporting my awful driving skills. We're already 60% through this race. Come on, Lambo. Every single time you start up a playlist, the world design for every single race is just so sick. All of the donuts all over the map, all of the billboards everywhere. It's so cool. No, 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 no. I'm saving up some NOS for this final corner. Ferrari, you shall not pass. There's the finish line. Hammer it for- Got him! <laughs> we had to do a little bit of murder, but Lamborghini wins! Let's go! All right, what's next? American Wrestle. I think it would be illegal if I didn't choose this. Wait, what am I doing? Am I doing an outrun mission? What about what? I didn't sign up for this. Okay, bro, whoa, 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 whoa. Why do I get the outside line, bro? That's not fair. My grandmother drives faster than this. Hey, you shut your mouth, James. Your grandmother's a nice lady. Not gonna lie, there's gonna be a problem here if I can't actually crash into the AI because that's the only way I can actually win a race. The road is just straight up not wide enough. Not from a big American muscle boy. That's the end of lap number one. I literally get the outside line for two laps. Are you kidding me? No, 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 no. That's not cool, game. That's not cool one bit. Retry. Rigged. Way more rigged than that Forza Horizon 5 challenge we did. I just noticed the Camaro driver's name is Homer and his car is yellow. Nice. I'm literally two and a half seconds behind. Changing the difficulty didn't do anything. Could I get a rigged in the chat? That was the most rigged race I have ever seen. They literally gave the Camaro the inside line, meaning that it had a shorter distance to go. Luckily for me, I didn't even need to win the event, so we'll take it anyway. Is that my first legendary part? Next event is, uh, oh, over there. We're doing high-low. No way. It's called high-low. Now. Chad, if I ever drive over like five bridges consecutively clean, call an ambulance because there's something wrong. All right, here we go. And in, 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 in. Nailed it. <laughs> This is the most jank high-low thing I've seen. Um, apparently the crew couldn't afford the license cost for low car or high car. Anyways, moving on. 
What am I even doing? I think I'm just doing like a point to point race. Let's go. This is actually one of my first times exploring Honolulu. It really does feel like test drive unlimited all over again. I absolutely love this. I'm really expecting to come around the corner and just see a big Ferrari dealership. You know what I mean? Come on, buddy. We're looking good. Hey. <laughs> Welcome to high car. It's not even the right color. <laughs> what are we doing? Okay, go, 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 Nismo. Go, buddy. Yo, look at the speed that we're carrying. It was like 200 miles an hour up that ramp. This lap is insanely quick. Chat says it's meh car and mid car. Yikes. The disrespect is real. There it is. There's the finish line. Look how much faster the second lap was. Lap one was a 138. Lap two was a 126. Jeez. All right. Well, high low car officially completed. I really hope after this playlist, I do not get gifted one of those two cars because that would just ruin me. Hey, and another legendary part. Thank you, game. DJ says the next event is going to be your everyday life. What does that mean? All right, and in. Beautiful. Mo Power Baby. Koenigsegg or Bugatti. Do we go Koenigsegg Jesco or do we go Cento Dieci, which is not how you pronounce it. I've driven a Jesco enough. Oh, someone woke up in a new Bugatti. What a reference. Look at it. Oh, Sorry. Bottled the launch. Bugatti versus Koenigsegg. I don't know what the top speed of this Bugatti is, but I know that Jesco is crack. Okay, go. It's also probably better than me in the corners. I have officially written off one of the world's most expensive cars. Okay, go, 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 Bugatti, go. That Jesco is insane. Bro, I'm three and a half seconds back. The Bugatti's just way too heavy to do well. He's pulling away more and more. It's like I'm not even driving slowly. The Koenigsegg's just insane. Okay, go, gun it, gun it, gun it. 290 miles an hour. Straight into a wall. <laughs> this is so silly. I'm not choosing the interesting car anymore. The Bugatti overpriced is not very fast. But what a disaster that was. Next event, please. Welcome to Drift. We're doing our first Drift event. We're driving a Mitsubishi Evo widebody. This thing actually looks pretty cool. Unfortunately for me, I am terrible at drifting in the Crew Motor Fest. I don't know why. Ever since the Crew crew one. I've never been able to drift in these games. There's just something about it that doesn't make sense for my brain. And I, I can't do it. I fully can't do it. I'm getting a nice multiplier. I lost the combo. Great. You love to see it. I'm trying to just kind of gun it through the corner. Press the handbrake to keep the drift going. Because to be honest, I don't think this car is fast enough. I'm barely going to get 100,000 points. I know it might look like I'm kind of drifting, but that felt terrible. 135,000 points. Luck Luckily, I didn't need to get any score. We still get the XP. We still get the money. That was actually a very fast event. All right, next. Chad, I like this mission already. This is the best mission in the game. So we know you're a capable driver. What if you don't have any brakes? What? Wait, for real? So I don't have any brakes. My throttle doesn't do anything. Look, my th this does nothing. Oh my God. This is so cool. This is why I really like the crew because just some of the missions out there are so unique and so much fun. Once we cross the finish line, our car is going to go faster. So 37 miles an hour to 49 miles an hour. Okay. Crew developers, we need more missions like this. This is so much fun. Take back what I just said. This mission sucks. Speed increases to 56 miles an hour. I don't know if there's like a certain requirement I need. So I'm going to try to drive as cleanly as possible. Let's go really wide here. Oh, the handbrake doesn't work. <laughs> I thought I could rip the handbrake and slide through the corner. What is going on? There we go. Now I've done a skid. Aha! I love how I figure it out on the final lap. But I'm actually supposed to drift it through. Really? Ah! <laughs> That is an awful mission, but I love it. We've got our final donut media event. Let's go. What is our special car that we can win? The final mission for donut media. Audi, orange, spider, 
head to head with BMW M4. Who could ask for anything more? Some people might say a Mercedes C63 AMG or a Black Series. They've given me the option of a coupe or a supercar. Easy choice. Audi R8 is one of the best cars ever made. If for whatever reason I lose this event, game is officially rigged, washed, L plus ratio. Go Audi, BMW is all sorts of offline. What type of racy line are you taking, bro? Man's too busy snorting. <laughs> that was karma. Could you stay on the road? That'd be nice. AI's gone again. Straight through the donut. That's pretty sick. Beautiful. Keep going. We're still on lap one. I still have plenty of time to catch up to this plebe. Cut the corner. Yeah, yeah. Do what he's doing. No breaks there. And here we go. Up the inside, baby. Let's go. Oh, he did a switch back. Well played. Now we gun it, though. How is that M4 so fast? Okay, here we go. Break in. Go. That's a racing line, buddy. If you no longer go for a gap, you no longer racing driver. And that's why I absolutely sent it. We've got the lead. Now we just need to... The BMW's all over the place. Man forgot how to drive. Ooh, R8's working well now. Two second lead, baby. Now that I took the right car, easy claps. All right, here we go. Use the NOS. Boost, baby. 200 miles an hour in the R8. Yeah, the BMW's gone. Man is miles and miles behind. I wonder what the special car is going to be for completing all of these missions is gonna be the NOS it to the finish line. And that is the donut media story completed. Audi takes victory. Love it. I think I only lost like 70% of those challenges, but the game was nice and actually let me beat them. 16,000 bucks. We've really got a mill in the bank now. Look at all the max level parts. Fantastic. And boys, our reward is just up here. So if we open up the map, we can fast travel back to the donut media headquarters. Quarters? Wait, what is that? Is that like a Focus? Is that a Corvette C8 wide body? <gasps> now that is a sick looking car. Every time I unlock a special car in this game, it's so goddamn cool. 75,000 bucks has officially been obtained. We are nearly at a mill. We are looking good. A wide body Corvette C8. What a sick looking thing. Now this is what I'm talking about.